Wow. Um, it looks like the transfer news, the transfer window is holding up, certainly for United anyway. Hey, 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 guys. It is Old Man G here back again with another video for Red Devil Studio. And today we're going to talk about Eduardo Camavinga to Manchester United. If you're new to the channel, to like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio, for some you like, smash the notification button, play this United news, and then some. So this is going to come to and Barna, who's the GOAT when it comes to transfers right now. Um, and this seems to come out of the blue, really, although there were some murmurings. And he's basically saying United are progressing direct contacts to sign Eduardo Camavinga. Rens would be open to negotiate on a potential 30 million euro fee as they lose Camavinga the free next summer. He's one of United's long-term targets. PSG have also always been interested as well. And that's the key thing here is that, you know, we have the money for that. I don't know, disagree with that. Or certainly we could sell the players to do that. Um, but will we do it? Um, but if it's if it's confirmed these are one long targets, and Officer Vincent has, has, has said this, that we're interested in them, then you know, if you're now thinking Kamavinga, Varan Sancho, and suddenly thinking this is a good window for Manchester United if we go and do it. The worry here for me in this particular deal, and I try and be realistic in these videos, sort of hyping and where's he plays is PSG because PSG have shown interest in Kamavinga. Um, and Lofa Bitsu in a previous tweet did say that this has nothing to do with um, Pogba. My worry would be, well, is this a situation where, um, you know, if PSG and United aren't direct uh, rivalry for um, Kamavinga, that PSG say, well, okay, fine, you have him, Kamavinga, but we'll make an agreement between United that you sell you sell um, Pogba to us for a certain fee. Um, whether that's right or wrong, I don't know, but that, but that, but that, but that could be that. Um, Interesting, as I put on a tweet, it'd be interesting if we did buy Kamavinga. I would actually, I would genuinely like to see if you, if we could play Kamavinga and Van der Beek and the double pivot instead of Freddie McTominay and see how it goes. Because quite frankly, Freddie McTominay are not C, are not CDMs, and they don't play, they don't play as CDMs for their country either. Um, so I'd be interested to see, like, hey, if, Cam, if we get Kamavinga and Van der Beek, play them in that double pivot, and then play Bruno Pogba up there and see what happens. But you never know. But yeah. Um, Obviously, Camavinga is, is is rated highly. He's still only 18. He's still got a lot of development to go, and it would obviously be a, be a major step up from Rennes to United for him, so we've got to bear that into account. But to be honest, for 30 million euro, which would be about equivalent of 23 um, million pounds, that's a steal. That's a steal. Considering that we paid more than that for Falcana Palestri, who's now on loan, 23 million for someone who's basically going to slot into our first team or compete on the first team, is, is an amazing so that's what i think anyway guys let me know your thoughts in the comments covering tonight do you think it's a good deal what are your thoughts comment below subscribe share like smash the notification button have a nice day everyone and cheers